Brake fluid is an essential component in your car's braking system. If the level is too low, it can actually affect the effectiveness of your brakes, which can be very dangerous. However, topping up your brake fluid is pretty easy. Let's take a look at how it's done. Firstly, check your handbook to see the location of the master cylinder and where to top up. This is usually located under the bonnet on the driver's side of the car, toward the back of the engine compartment. The brake master cylinder is a small rectangular piece of metal with a plastic reservoir and a rubber cap on top and small metal tubes leading from it. The cap will usually read, use only DOT3 or 4 brake fluid from a sealed container. On most modern cars, the reservoir is see-through and you can see the fluid level without removing the cap. There will be a full line. The brake fluid should be at this level. If not, add brake fluid to the full line. Make sure you use the correct brake fluid for your car. If the reservoir has two parts, fill both halves. Refit the cap and close the bonnet. Low brake fluid levels can be very dangerous and can actually cause your brakes to fail, so you need to make sure you check those levels every week. Also, brake fluid needs to be changed every two to three years. Additionally, it's worth noting that if you are having to top up, you may well have a leak. In some cars, there is a brake fluid warning light which will come on if the level gets too low. If you think you have a leak in your braking system, then pop into your local Unipark car care centre where one of our friendly team will be happy to help you. You can find your local Unipark car care centre at www.uccc.co.uk